Sahih al Bihari 64 narrated Abdullah bin Abbas, one Salah's messenger, gave a letter to a person and ordered him to go and deliver it to the governor of Bahrain. He did so, and the governor of Bahrain sent it to Choros, who read that letter and then tore it to pieces. The sub-narrator Ibn Shahab thinks that Ibn al-Musayyib said that Allah's messenger invoked Allah against them, saying, May Allah tear them into pieces, and disperse them all totally. Sahih al bihari 65 narrated Anas bin Malik, once the Prophet wrote a letter or had an idea of writing a letter. The Prophet was told that they, rulers, would not read letters unless they were sealed. So the Prophet got a silver ring made with Muhammad Allah's messenger, engraved on it. As if I were just observing its white glitter in the hand of the Prophet. Sahih al bihari 66 narrated Abu Waqid al-Laythi, while Allah's messenger was sitting in the mosque with some people, three men came. Two of them came in front of Allah's messenger, and the third one went away. The two persons kept on standing before Allah's messenger for a while and then one of them found a place in the circle and sat there while the other sat behind the gathering, and the third one went away. When Allah's messenger finished his preaching, he said, Shall I tell you about these three persons? One of them betook himself to Allah, so Allah took him into his grace and mercy and accommodated him, the second felt shy from Allah, so Allah sheltered him in his mercy and did not punish him, while the third turned his face from Allah and went away, so Allah turned his face from him likewise.